Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and manga readers from around the world. <laughs> this is your friend Mario Kusakabe bringing you another episode of Manga Time. That is correct, Manga Time. Yeah, but if I'm not mistaken, this is episode. Oh my god, 18. That's a lot. That's a lot. That's a lot. I knew I would be doing Manga Time like all the other shows for quite some time. Because the guys from innercitygeeks.com, they're really awesome. They tell me, do whatever you want to do, whatever you want to read, we have your back. I'm like, really appreciate it. But for me to be doing actually all this reading, and for them to allow me just to do my. It's truly awesome. Those guys are truly awesome. And these people should be part it's possible me already because god I drink a lot of that stuff. It's gonna kill me one day. <laughs> so yeah guys, um today's episode of Magnetism. It's about a lovely anime. Sorry, manga. That I hold dear. That I like a lot. Um I'm talking about fairy tale. Ah, fairy tale. Yes, fairy tale. This will be um chapter 501. We are still at the war. Fighting the war. Um, on this chapter, Lucy is fighting um, Randy. As we all know, Randy is one of the Spring and Twelve. But um, once she got to Fairy Tale and got to talk after she got kicked um, in prison by Fairy Tale, um, she actually began to realize that there's another way uh, for them to be free, for the war to stop. Because she actually became a fan of um, Natsu, Lucy, and they just you know, want to stop the war in a civilized way. Maybe. So this is what the elite does. Uh, they're going, you see out of nowhere, um, Randy uh, turning their back on, on them, telling them, look, uh, as much as I like you guys, I will forgive you, but I'm going to kill everyone else from your, from your guild. Because I am a loyal person to my country and to my emperor, and I have to beat you guys. You guys are my enemy. So that the tumor that Natsu had, that it was giving me the problems, she's not breathing. She shrunk. She from shrinking it, put it back up. So now it's crazy. So Natsu's oh, oh back in pain. So then Lucy. Even though she knows she's out muscle with magic power against Randy, uh, Ghost Toro told, you know, they made a deal, if you beat me, if I beat you, Lucy says, uh, you let us free, you come back with us, and you help Nats. Okay. She goes, I'll play along. So the, f the fight begins, and Lucy is kind of doing her thing. So, <clears throat> again, she starts with the Lucy kick, as we all know. Really? So that continues with the Lucy Kick and then she throws some um, her multiple powers of um, the Zodiac. And actually only she's doing her thing, that throws a few cool moves in there. But we can see that during the fight that she is actually has no chance against this girl. Against Randy, because Randy is like too strong. But then another of the Spring in 12 showed up, which is Maddie. And that's funny because then Maddie goes, stop this, stop this fight. Um, cause all oh, this is a charade, this is a ruse, you're actually not one to kill them. She's like, what do you mean? I'm fighting with him. I'm like, no, cause she goes, if you really wanted to kill her, you would shrink all his organs or make enlarge his organs and he would have exploded already. Or if you really wanted to, cause she's strong to Lucy, but Lucy like, use her first shifting the Zodiac and like, got free. So I'm like, so like, if you really wanted her, you could just shrink her so much and like, grab your fist and like kill her destroyer, but you did it. So you just make it this ruse because you knew that I was out here. So to make believe something. But she goes, I figure you out, um like you lie and I'm gonna kill you. So out of nowhere, actually supposedly she's so fast. Mighty just from one side to the page to the other side of the page moves. Cut cuts um, Randy starts to bleed, falls down. Lucy's like, what the heck do you just do? 
she uh, is a traitor to my country. So she has to die. And then she goes to Lucy, are you the ones that corrupted her mind? Because if that's the case, I am going to kill you now. That's where that ends. That's chapter 501. I'm like, holy crap, Lucy's gonna get her ass beat. But now, I wanna talk something about the previous chapter, chapter 500. Where um, Gray is fighting. And he beats um, the wizard from uh, the Spriggan 12. One of the 12 guys, the strongest guys on the Spriggan. And he reveals the identity of who N is. Yes. And as we all know, we have been reading the manga. He reveals that Natsu is N. So that's crazy right there. It opens like a world of possibilities. Now what Grey is gonna do, because supposedly Grey is the only one that could kill N. That's it. No one else. So I'm like, holy crap. So with that and what's happening on 501, I'm like, how, how crazy is this? I'm like, fairy tale is truly, 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 I truly embrace fairy tale. I really enjoy it. It's fun, but it's crazy. Like, I, I, with a few friends, we have talked about what could be the end or the outcome of this. Um, and we're not truly sure. But this is leading to something very epic and crazy because this is, I think, one of the longest, if anything, longest wars uh, or epic chapters that they have had. So it, it's truly amazing how big, how massive it is. So, like, to see when it, it ends, like, I have some ideas maybe how it could, it's, it's truly <sighs> heart shattering. If, if I think I'm right, it's like heart shattering. So, <laughs> hopefully we'll see but yeah um, yeah guys thanks again for the time thanks for everything um, you guys go watch this episode of uh, Manga Time at InnerCityGeeks.com you could also watch it on my YouTube page and you can follow me at Twitter at BlackAdam001 alright guys thanks again man love peace